Today is Friday, February 28th, and it is an A day. Please stand at this moment for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for a moment of silence. You may now be seated. Today's lunch is pizza, chicken sandwich, baked potato wedges, steamed mixed vegetables, chilled strawberry cups, and milk. This is a reminder for the SDMS Bulldogs Attendance Challenge. This is a way to encourage students to come to school every single day. Students who have three or fewer days absent for terms three and four will receive a free movie pass to the flagship theaters in West Ocean City. Don't let your education slip away. Come to school every day. This month, Logo Water Challenge is hard. If you want to come down to get into the challenge, it ends this Friday. Attention all book lovers. The book fair starts this Monday and runs through Friday, March 6th. And starting now, you can pre-order books online if you sign up for eWallet. We have a special bonus hours too. On Thursday, before the drama performance, every purchase during the bonus hours gets a free gift. All the money we make at the book fair will be used to boost our school's library. Don't wait. Visit scholastic.com slash fair to sign up now for eWallet and shop until you drop. This year is very special because this year is a leap year, which happens every four years. A person born on February 29th may be called a leapling, a leaper, or a leap year baby. The scientific reason behind the leap year is Earth really takes 365 and a quarter days to resolve around the sun. Four quarters equals a whole day, so therefore every four years a whole day is added to the calendar. But did you know that Julius Caesar is known for be as being the father of leap year? He is behind the origin of leap year started in 45 BC because the early Romans had a 255 day calendar and to keep festivals current around the same season each year. Members of our school's Science Olympiad team will be traveling to a Science Olympiad competition tomorrow in Rockville, Maryland. Science Olympiad is a club that explores all kinds of fun science projects from engineering and physics to chemistry and biology. Science Olympiad also competes in various events around the region. If our school's team does well tomorrow, they could qualify for the states this April in Baltimore. Good luck to our Science Olympians. Sure, so eighth grade is right before you pick your high school coursework. So we want to show students the vast array of jobs that exist here on the shore. The, the salaries of those jobs, the skills needed to get that job, what kind of education you need. That way when you're picking your high school coursework, you can know ahead of time you know, that if you want to be in construction, you have to be good at geometry. If you want to be an engineer, you have to be good at math. That way you know, you're not making decisions that are going to hurt you down the road and you know what to do to be successful in your career. So we'll have 3,000 eighth graders here today from six counties across the eastern shore of Maryland. All students and staff show your Bulldog pride every day by being productive, responsible, involved, and determined. Have a great Friday!